Ever pondered the secret to achieving that perfect brown crust on your steak? The answer lies in a simple yet elegant cooking technique known as browning or searing. This process, when executed correctly, can elevate your steak from ordinary to extraordinary. And today, we're going to break down this culinary magic into simple, easy-to-follow steps. First things first, it's crucial to understand what browning or searing is. It's a method of cooking that involves applying high heat to the surface of the food, causing it to caramelize and form a brown crust. This process is scientifically known as the Maillard reaction, named after the French chemist who first described it. Step one in this process is selecting the right pan. A thick bottom pan, such as a cast iron skillet, is ideal for this purpose. The thickness of the pan ensures even heat distribution, preventing hot spots that could burn your food. Next, it's time to prep your steak. Pat it dry with paper towels to remove any excess moisture. Moisture is the enemy of browning. It creates steam and hinders the formation of that coveted crust. Now heat your pan over high heat until it's smoking hot. Add a thin layer of high smoke point oil like canola or grapeseed oil. Once the oil is shimmering, it's time to add your steak. Resist the urge to move the steak around in the pan. Let it sit undisturbed for about two to three minutes. This allows the Maillard reaction to take place, creating that deliciously brown crust. After two to three minutes, flip the steak over to sear the other side. Again, leave it undisturbed for another two to three minutes. And voila, you've now mastered the art of browning or searing. The result? A steak with a beautifully brown crust and a juicy, flavorful interior. In summary, the key to achieving that perfect brown crust on your steak is understanding and executing the browning or searing process. First, choose the right pan and prep your steak by patting it dry. Then, heat your pan until it's smoking hot and add a thin layer of oil. Add your steak, leaving it undisturbed for two to three minutes on each side to allow for the Maillard reaction to take place. Remember, practice makes perfect. So don't be discouraged if your first few attempts don't yield the desired results. Keep refining your technique, and soon you'll be serving up steak with a beautifully browned crust that is sure to impress.